Once upon a time, there were two kick-ass ladies living in New York, singing songs and drinking margaritas. And one day, one of these kick-ass ladies had a kick-ass idea. If you could do anything with your talent, what would you do? I want to make comic books. And together, they created the greatest song in the world, known as Hex Comics. <laughs> oh my god, did you guys hear that? Traditionally, most comic books are written by men for a male audience. But these women are challenging this stereotype by telling unique stories through non-traditional voices with a fraction of the team. If you've ever looked at a comic book and you open up the front cover and see all the people whose work goes into making that 24-page comic happen, it's usually five to seven people, sometimes more. But when you open our book, it's one, it's Lisa. The idea for Hex 11 came into my head a long, long time ago. After about 14 years of bouncing around in my head, I felt it was ready to be told. Hex 11 is the story of a world where magic has been discovered like it's a new technology and has created a lot of social disruption for the people who live in this world. We've got the art, we've got the story, well, we need a writer. When Lisa sent me these character breakdowns, these world descriptions, as I was reading it, I think I actually whispered out loud to myself, oh my god, this is literally Harry Potter and Blade Runner. She came into the fold and was able to then take these incredible characters and the scenario that Lisa had created and give them all individual voices. Those two together, it was magic. It's actually been really inspiring to see women that are not only interested in things that I'm interested in, but being very successful in producing some really beautiful work. My hope always is they read these stories, identify with these characters, and then we'll go into their life feeling you don't need magic to do magical things. We hope to inspire that people can find the courage in themselves to know that their story is good and it should be told.